Yes, indeed. We back on a two real tools to y'all. And hey, yes, I'm still in my pride mode with my pride umbrella. <laughs> in the rain, baby. You dig? Now, I'm fed, I knew know what. I'm about to cover something really controversial. Well, it's only controversial to people who don't understand, but to those who, who are in tune and tell me, we get it. Now, we're going to talk about the concept of love, y'all. Let's get into it. Because when I see people saying shit like, well, what's love? What? Oh, shout out to Tina Turner. May she rest in eternal peace. But I got to disagree with my sis, my auntie. My bad, auntie. I got to disagree with auntie on one thing. And that was one of her biggest songs that she ever created. Now, she created what's love got to do with it. My response is to that. Hell, love got everything to do with it. It has everything to do with it. Because you have to start with yourself. There has to take place self-love, self-evaluation, self-work. You must do these things in order to get the grasp on what love truly means. So when you see people questioning What's love? What is it? What's the concept? What's the definition? You know, trying to constantly answer and ask these questions. You know why they asking these questions? Because they have not started with self. They have not given themselves a full display of care, protection, a uh, 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 sympathy, empathy. They have not done the, the work. The work has not been done. The full work that must be done. Whether it takes the rest of your fucking life to do it. It has to be done for you to understand what love looks like. You got to be the example first. How in the hell are you going to understand it? in someone else or give it to somebody if you ain't got it for yourself that just makes common sense but see there is let me tell y'all something there's a level of brokenness that you have to have there's a level of humbleness you have to have you understand what i'm saying you have to have a level of brokenness you have to have a level of humbleness and you, have to, you also have to have a dose of bitch just look at the facts of yourself, how you treat yourself, the reality. How do you feel about you? That's why knowledge of self is extremely important. You must know thyself first. So to keep questioning, what's love, what it mean? You have to be your own definition for you to understand it you have to be your own definition of it. So again, I will say this. What's love got to do with it? Hell, everything. Everything. <laughs> Shit, love got to do with everything. Because you damn sure can't give out to nobody else what you ain't got. That's just like you can't loan nobody money, no money if you ain't got no money. How the hell you gonna love somebody you ain't got no one? You ain't got no love to give, cause you don't love you. And you have to understand what that means. So, my thing is, you know, if you out there questioning what love is, it's because you haven't given it to yourself. You have not taken the time to give the work, to, the mo to do the work, and give love to the most important person that you could give it to, which is you. Love is everything. It's protecting your peace, protecting your space, your energy, your boundaries, respecting yourself, not allowing somebody to come in and disrespect you. No matter how much, you know, 
blood uh, related you are to them or whatever it means. You are responsible for you. So, if you can't look at the mirror and see love, then you got work to do. Anyway, this is a two real Tuesday. And the message has to be the message. What love got to do with it? Hell. Everything.